Hey, my name is Andy, and uh, I'm from the Chicagoland area. And it's a privilege to be here in the Philippines. Uh, right now, we are in a province outside Manila, and uh, right now we're doing a feeding program. And uh, for me, it's just been uh, such a blessing to be here and uh, to minister to the children. The children here in the Philippines are really precious, and. Uh, uh, you know, uh, the kids here in the Philippines, they really have a special uh, special spot in my heart, just, I guess, kids in general. Um, when I was a kid, when I was a, uh, actually born, uh, I was born with a hole in my heart. And, um, you know, doctors said that uh, the likelihood of me living past the age of 14 was, you know, it was really 50-50 chance. Um, and I had to go in and have open heart surgery. And, uh, you know, it was an option that they gave my, uh, my guardians, you know, do you want to proceed with this surgery or not? And if I was to succeed, I'd probably just end up being a vegetable. And here, 25 years later, I'm, I'm here in the Philippines and it's, uh, it's great. So, uh, you know, what perfect example is, uh, you know, what man can say is hopeless. You know, in Christ we have hope. And I think that's just such a testimony here, being here in some of these more impoverished uh, uh, places. Um, you know, you see how these people live, and you know, from the outside looking in, it really looks hopeless. And then you look at these children, and you see the hope that they have when we bring food to them, when we sing with them, and uh, just uh, it's a real blessing to be here. And, Regardless of what people may say they may become or their expectancy, knowing that Christ is not finished with them and some of these people can go on and can get out of these situations, they can become doctors, they can become pastors, missionaries, uh, working in the marketplace, whatever that may be, and it's, uh, it's just a blessing to be here.